February is known as Heart Month, and one man is opening up to us about surviving a heart attack. 13 News Now reporter Megan Shen introduces us to how he's sharing his message one volunteer at a time. Hello, Jan. Inside Centera Norfolk General's Heart Hospital, Ruth Vanderpool is one of the first faces patients see. When they don't know where they're at in the hospital. They're scared. You know, they're crying. In those stressful moments, Vanderpool knows how to calm people down. Looking at him now, it takes a second glance to tell he came to Centera as a patient just three years ago. You know, most people don't even realize that this is hanging on my body. That item is an LVAD. It's a mechanical pump used for patients who survived serious heart failure. He got it after having a massive heart attack. This is the picture I like to show people. In May of 2018, I was gone. They had to shock me 25 times. You know, and it's just like in the movies, by the way. <laughs> now for the past three months, Vanderpool lightens up the halls of Sintera. He comes back twice a week to volunteer at the registration desk. But you know, when you help people here, you get what I tell them is a hug from the soul. Morning. He even goes above and beyond by visiting current patients like Lonnie Peterson. That's my lifeline. Peterson says talking to Vanderpool puts him at ease because he understands. Once you realize that your lifeline is in question, it changed your whole format about everything that you do and say. Vanderpool even has a way of connecting with the patient's families. Are you taking good care of yourself? During this heart month, it's one man's way of living his life to the fullest and giving back to the place that saved his life. In Norfolk, Megan Shin, 13 News Now.